Right, I had to have a bit of a delay there while the battery ran out. I had to go and get energizer. So I can carry on now. It took about nearly half an hour to sort that problem out. I couldn't just fast wind it to see if I missed anything. I'd have to have gone back, see. Oh, give me a chance to cool down though. I was getting quite hot. So back there then we've got a parish. We've got Cornelius John Parish in that grave there, look. And behind there's the original old stone as well, which I never noticed earlier. There's the tower there. Yeah, it's quite warm. So I'm now up this end. This is video two now. Um, the other, the Cornelius John Parish will be on video one most of it. I'm just leaving that particular grave so I'm coming this way. Um, so it just shows you've got to keep an eye open because I'm nearly, I didn't see that other parish old gravestone the first time round see. I didn't even see it. There was something funny up the tree there, something wedged. Like a, like a big old branch that's got wedged in there look. Very strange. Nice. Anyway, here, by mis well, not by mistake, by accident, this has been tidied up. This, and I noticed um, an Edwin Parish died December nineteen twenty-eight, age sixty-four. It looks Edwin. And round here we've got Bertie, their son, died 1930, aged 40. And then round here we've got Loving Memory of Ellen Parrish, she died something July 1935 I think or, I think it's 35 could be an 8 not sure I think a 33 aged 92 so there's a great big rectangular stone we've got Ellen Bertie and Edwin in here and after someone's tidied it up you can see the writing you see and that's this side of the church, back here. So that's parish again. There's also M Emma Jane Coombs. I do Coombses. She died in 1891, age 33. It's one of my Somerset families. I sometimes record, not so much now. I've got to go around again because now I've lost the momentum. Yeah, I know there's nothing there. Um, there's a woolly there, not a holly, a woolly. Um, let's go over this, just check this one. Yeah, there's a, that's a priest's grave there. William Creek Rowland, priest, died in 1930 at age 84. And Louisa, his wife, she died in 1939, age 92. That was probably once an upright Celtic cross on there. So we carry on wandering. Got another churchyard to do yet. Don't even know if it hang up, if it hold out the the um, charger yet. So I had to play that back. So I would have to have repeated something. So they're over there, that parish family. Look, those trees are markers for that. I've got a Francis Charles Hill. I took note of that because sometimes Barbara's ancestors were Hale or Hill. Um, t changes in name are common in the past. Um, it confuses people. They People think, oh, it can't possibly be mine. It's got an E in it. But no, it was common. Very, very common to change names. 
So that's that Francis Charles Hill there. We've got a Mika over there. I'm going to do that in a minute. I'm just checking these ones. And I can't remember if I'd done these or not. Oh yeah, these were um, the, the Jeans one. Lawrence, Florence Jane Jeans. She died in 1987, age 64. And Frederick Joseph Jeans. He died in 1979. And then next to them there's somebody that died in 1953, a Frederick Walter Jones, died in eight, when he was 81. And Sarah Jane, she died in 1961. It's because somebody, there's, I know somebody with that name, so just in case it's related, you see. They've been tidying up some of these graves, by the way. Um, yeah, and it's not that one. Not that one either. Um, yeah, no, this is the one. Next to this, a big old fashioned uh, table like one. We've got some. Um, I put it, I found a glass down there. I dug it up and I put it on this grave. We've got Sarah Ann Meeker. No, we've got Aaron Meeker. Died the 7th of February 1939, age 68. And Sarah Ann Meeker died. The 13th of November 1943, age 75. So this Mika crew might be related to Beverly. I put a little, um, some little acorns of that big fern tree. I, I presented that there today. So there we've got Aaron Mika, look. And Sarah Ann Mika. They are positioned, um, this side of the um, church again, nice, really nice place, nice and sunny look when the sun comes out. And this huge, looks like a red fern tree from America to me, um, like they've got up in Schoon Palace Garden. I've seen some of those, the redwoods. So it looks like a redwood tree, definitely. Yeah, say hello tree. I think I checked all these. Um, I don't think there was any over this way now. I, I can't remember. But um, yeah, so there's that, that Mika grave there. I just feel that there was someone else, but um, possibly not. I can't, I really can't remember, to be quite honest. But look at the size of that tree though. Beautiful, isn't it? Yeah, it's definitely like a redwood. I don't think I missed anyone out there. No, I think that was it. There might be somebody here. I'll have to go through it because I can't remember. But I'll go through it again. I'm just doing a video of this is an updated version. Um, an updated video. Just in case, once again, there's a lovely view of the church there, look. So we've got parish graves right at the top. We've got Mika's here. I don't think we've got anyone else. I think this will be it. I just feel I've missed someone out, but I would have taken a photograph. I would have taken a photograph. Right, over and out everyone.